Bikers Against Child Abuse, BACA, exists with the intent to create a safer environment for abused children. They exist as a body of bikers. To empower children to not be afraid in the world in which they live. All right, buddy, you have a good one. See you later, man. How you doing? My name's Chief. I'm a licensed clinical social worker and I'm also a registered play therapist, which means I work with small children between the ages of three and eight. And most of the time I work with kids who've been abused and kids who have been uh, hurt in one way or another. And during the time of my practice, uh, I would see these children about once a week. They'd come in and they'd make incremental change, they'd make some good changes and things. And that could get undone so quickly by a perpetrator who would cruise by the house or who would uh, have access to the child that my work was greatly compromised and my frustration grew and grew. And because of the childhood experiences that I had with bikers, I thought maybe, maybe we could take the streets back, maybe we could make the world just a little bit safer for these kids. And so I decided that uh, maybe I would just ask some of my biker friends if they'd be willing to help me support a child. And what became very apparent to me at that time was the fact that people want to fight child abuse, but they didn't have an organized way to do it. And so when I put out the call and that first ride when we had 27 motorcycles show up to the ride, there were about 40 people, the vision started to become clearer and clearer that this is something that could work in a way that we could help children in a very, very substantial way. The first level of intervention that we have and when we uh, visit and help children is to have a ride. And uh, you're gonna see some of that as we go to these children's homes and uh, we become a force in their lives and create a safer environment for them. So what we'll do is we go to the child's home and when we get there, uh, we park, we go in mass, we take a chapter, the whole chapter goes, we go and we uh, become part of that child's family. And as we become part of that child's family, they become part of our family. And the message is very clear that when you're part of our family, we don't run, we don't hide, we don't take cover, we stand tall and we'll stand right beside you, in front of you, in back of you, or all around you to make sure that you're safe. <laughs> okay, you see your name's right here, just like that. And that one there's just like the one on your sister's. This is also to let you know that you're part of the family, okay? We're always gonna be there for you, all right? You're in a hurry, aren't you? <laughs> all right, Wings, there's your name. And then on the back, it's the same thing, the same patch to let you know you're part of our family. All right, we're always gonna be there for you, no matter what. During that first ride, then two primary contacts are assigned to follow up with that child. These are two 
patched members who have gone through a, a very strenuous process to become members. They'll, they'll take these, uh, these children under their wing and they'll follow up every week, every two weeks, and they'll let the chapter know what kind of needs this child has. So we really look at ourselves as filling a gap. <laughs> Love you guys. The adoption is probably one of the most critical parts of uh, things that we do in Baca. And uh, it is uh, the first level that we do in uh, establishing a connection with, with the kids. And what we, what we do is we go out in force and we, get, we make a physical presence in the neighborhood and we adopt them into our family and we introduce ourselves to them. And we, uh, more than anything, we just try and connect with them. We, uh, we become their friends and we earn their trust on a very on a very superficial level at the beginning but then as we continue that relationship that uh, that trust becomes power for the children and when it becomes power for the children they can do what they need to do our helpline had rang just the other day another child's innocence has been stripped away well we'll all round up together Riding on two wheels in the wind Cause we say what we mean And we mean what we say Do whatever it takes To make your fears go away No matter the time Be it night, be it day We're coming to see you And bring you on in And we'll be riding on two wheels in the wind We want children to have the right, we believe it's the inalienable right of a child to be happy and to pursue whatever happiness that they want as long as it's not violating the rights of other people. One of the integral things that we do in Baca is we go to court with our friends and when they become part of the family, it's very important that we follow through with what we say that we're going to do and part of that is to go to court with them. These, these guys right here, my brothers, man, we, uh, we, wouldn't let them, we wouldn't let them go face something like that all by themselves. You guys ready to go to court? Mm -hmm. All right, let's do it. All right. Let's go. Do you see the man? Yes, I do. Can you point him out to me? Cause we say what we mean, and we mean what we say. Do whatever it takes to make your fears go away. No matter the time, be it night, be it day. Was it good to have people at court with you, buddy? Mm-hmm. Yeah? How about you, King Tut? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Tool boy? Yes. Yeah? Yes. All right. We're all in this together, and that's how we feel about it in Baca. We need these kids to feel safe in order to be able to talk about what really happened. Our job is to empower them and teach them just how powerful they can be. And once they discover how powerful they can be, the rest just falls into place. 
and uh, they can they can tell the truth about what happened to them. These people can get prosecuted, taken off the streets. And when you're looking around and you see that the average pedophile is perpetrating on over 400 children in a lifetime, taking one of those people off the streets is a very big thing, and that's the courage that these children have in order to go into these courtroom situations and actually point their finger and say, that's the guy. And that's where we come in. We say, you don't have to be scared anymore, and we will do whatever it takes to make sure that you're not afraid anymore. When you see your little girl grinning from ear to ear after what all they've been through, that's what Baca does. The one thing we can offer as bikers is a brotherhood that comes to the house and says, we will do what we say and we will not go away until if every one of us has to die to keep you safe, then that's what it'll take. Because this is a war. When you look around you and you see that one out of every, every three girls and one out of every five boys has been sexually abused in some way, you cannot call this anything but an epidemic. And that's what it is in our country. And we're the plague to that epidemic. We're the plague to child abuse. And we will do all that we can to eradicate that. And that's the attitude we need to have of our members. Our members have to be committed. They have to be passionate. Uh, have to be a little bit crazy about kids. Because if I get knocked down, I guarantee you there'll be 20 there tomorrow. And if those 20 get knocked down, there'll be 50. And they'll come from all over the country and around the world. And those children get a sense of that, and they know that. And they know that we will stand as an obstacle to any further harm being done towards that child and um, whatever that means and whatever that takes. Even if it be a million and one foe, we go. And, uh, that, and that's what we do. So that's our reward, to watch the faces of these children light up again, watch the life just come right back into them, the life that was beaten out of them, the life that was taken away from them, their innocence that was stolen in the night by some thoughtless thug, and then to have this wave of love come at them from all sides like this and encircle them, that's our reward. Thank you for riding with me. Thank you, Baka. I love you, Baka. You rock, Baka. As they say what they mean, and they mean what they say. They do whatever it takes to make our fears go away. No matter the time, be it night, be it day. Be with you and bring you on in, and they'll be riding on too.